Greetings. Welcome to the Bend, Missouri Kayak and Weather Report for February 2023. At 11 o'clock in the morning on Tuesday, February 7th, the temperature is 48 degrees with a predicted high of 54. Teens and 20s at night temperature after today is supposed to drop off, bounce around high 30s, high 40s, and then back up to the high 50s by the weekend. And uh, rain is predicted for tomorrow evening, Wednesday. They're expecting about an inch of rain. Nothing on the forecast again until another week after that. So yeah, we can use the rain. We definitely can use the rain. It is Overcast, well, scattered clouds, I guess you would say. So there is some blue sky behind me or around me. And I am on the Moreau River. I launched at the Moreau 50 access. It's called that because the ramp is right near US 50 on the Moreau River, yeah. And I have not been here since June because the water's been low, you know, or ice last month and so um, since it's been warm the past few days actually yesterday would have been a better day we had a high of like 64 degrees uh, but I had a noon dentist appointment so that kind of screwed things up kayaking wise so I'm out here today but anyway the water at the ramp is the lowest that I've ever seen it and I assumed when I saw that that I probably wouldn't get very far downstream and I was right I've gotten less than a half a mile, 0.45 miles, 45 one hundredths of a mile, yeah. And I've already found myself hung up on rocks where I'm just kind of sitting in place spinning, trying to push off without getting in the water. And uh, behind me, um, you can see some, what should show you that it's, it's Ah, uh, shallower. Where is that? Back in there, yeah, you can see it. You can see where it's moving rapidly or going over rocks, gravel. And that is the point, let's zoom out. That is the point where I believe it was last year, somewhere around February, where I thought I could get past that. And I did, I got past it. And when I came back upstream, I had to get out of the kayak and walk through muck. Yeah, to get about 100 yards upstream to where I could actually get to a point where I could launch off of gravel and not be standing in mud as I launched. So, hey, here it is, February, same thing, but it, the water's lower than I've ever seen it. So there you have it. I've seen a couple of big raptors that were circling overhead, not quite overhead, they were in the distance. Uh, probably not more than a couple hundred yards, but past that spot that I am not going to paddle over. Yeah, so. And I'm thinking they're probably eagles. Look like juveniles, because I didn't see any white tails, but they were a good size. Oh, wow. A great horned owl just flew right past me. How cool is that? Yeah, wow. There used to be um, one of the trees within the first quarter mile of, of the launch had a nest in it that one year was red-tailed hawks and a couple of other years around the, before and after the, the hawks there was a great horned owl in there but that's gone it's it's gone I think it when that tornado came through it took that right out of the tree this is a dead tree too so it won't be long before that's in the river because a lot of these are really leaning they're leaning in at like a 30 degree angle out over the river so another couple of years I'll probably be down in the water yeah, and that's another thing. Uh, I'm coming across giant trees, you know, that are sitting on the bottom, partially exposed. Yeah, almost like alligators. Yeah. Or would that be crocodiles? No, it'd be alligators here in the States, wouldn't it? Anyway, uh, <clears throat> that's it for wildlife. I'm hearing some bird calls, but I can't tell what they are. Um... <sighs> Not a lot going on since last time. It was only 10 days ago that I did my January kayak. So, um, 
had open mic last night at Cumble Bottoms. That was nice. That went well. Julianne King was the featured reader. Always enjoy hearing her read. And next month will be Leslie Day. And uh, of course there was open mic after, so I read a few poems there. That was nice. And uh, looking into the possibility of maybe reading at Spine Books in St. Louis. They're looking for featured readers, I hear. So, you know, maybe, if, not, if nothing else, I'll go there as an open mic, so. I'm looking into that. So yeah. Uh, the trip to Wyoming looks like that will now be in March. Yeah, if it develops at all, looks like it'll be in March. And that's it. Oh yeah, I don't know if I talked about this. I know I talked about my Maverick, my pickup compact pickup Maverick that's ordered. I got a, another email. Yeah, it was after the last paddle. I got an email a week after notifying me that it was going to be built on the week of March 13th and that it had been changed. And it's going to be built the week of March 6th now. So I'm looking forward to that. Well, anyway, uh, not a lot else to talk about. So I'm going to cautiously paddle upstream and hope I don't run into those rocks. Oh yeah, right next to me. This is pretty cool. Well, pretty cool. Too sad for somebody. <laughs> yeah, it's a boat anchor. It's wedged under that rock. It probably weighs about 400 pounds. So, yeah. But I'm out of here. This has been your Mid-Missouri Kayak and Weather Report for February 2023. Ciao folks and vlog on.